I like my rocket ship flying in circles. Greetings everybody, Okami Games Online, welcome back to more Pikmin, last time. We got 100% in the impact site by getting a whole one piece, yay for only two pieces in this area. And we found it to be a really good place to go if you need to build up your Pikmin numbers, as you can see by the numbers in the bottom half of the screen. And in this episode, we're heading back to the Force Naval. We've got four parts left, let's see if we can get a few of them knocked out in this episode. Now, from what I remember last time we were here, there was a piece we were starting to get back. We didn't get it back, but we started to get it back. And it should be this star right here. There's also a piece all the way out there, so let's get down to business. Let's go ahead and start out by getting out 50 reds. And we'll get out 25 blues. And then the rest can be made up of yellows. Don't throw the pigment. Get under your onion. God, perspectiving issues. Alright. And I actually have a decent reason this time for why I pick red Pikmin, because they like to trip. Get up. But no, uh, we have to deal with fiery blowhogs still, so don't worry about the nectar either. Yeah, every... all the Pikmin in this squad are flowers. Okay. Was it... yeah, we're going to have to go through some fiery blowhogs. So let's split our Pikmin. Okay, fine. You can go get nectar for all I care. I just need the reds so we can take out these fiery blowhogs. You can't do a thing to my Pikmin. Well, you can deflowerize them, but other than that, you can't do a thing. Alright. Actually, why am I even bothering to fight them? All I need to do is go grab the piece. And get yeah, this. Go pick this up. Since the fiery blowheads can't do anything, they can just take this back without even have to worry about anything. See? I don't know what I was so worried about. So where are there other pieces? There should be... Yes, there is another one this way. Which piece is this way? Based on where it's located... Oh, Lovely. Yep. We're gonna need bomb rocks. Problem is, I don't remember where we get some bomb rocks. So... Looks like this day might end up being a little bit of fumbling about trying to figure out where to go. Lovely. At least we'll get a piece back. Alright, well, let's just keep in mind that one's going to require us to get some bomb rocks. So we'll keep that in mind, and we're going to take the rest of our Pikmin's. I think I remember where bomb rocks are. I think last time we were here, I couldn't figure out how to get bomb rocks out of here. Which was not fun. It was very not fun. Alright, where? You know what? I should probably just go do some exploring on my own. While I try to... Or they could get that piece back, and I do not realize it. And I could now have to go get that pick... My Pikmin back. Anti-deoxin filter. The laws of deep space require all ships to eliminate all pollutants. 16 out of 30. We can just find 13 more. We should be able to increase our ship's flying capabilities. Well, I guess we're heading back there now. Great. Productivity at its finest. At least all our Pikmin should be in this general area. I also just realized we had a Pikmin casualty. Oh well. He will be missed. Okay. Don't worry about... Oh, whatever. Worry about for all I care. We've still got 94 Pikmin in our squad. That should be enough to get what we need to get done. Done. Oh. This might be where those casualties will suffer. Okay, let's just 
get rid of them so they're not causing trouble. Oh, fiery blowhogs. I guess I knew you were there, so why am I sounding surprised? I may never know. Ah, oh, crap. Okay, um... Let's just do this, because nothing can possibly go wrong. I really hope we don't lose Pikmin to them being thrown out of bounds. Doesn't look like we did. Okay. We've got a gate here to destroy. They're going to be on that for a while. We might be able to get a few things done. Oh, I just need... Pikmin AI is great. Okay, I need the yellows. My god. Okay, toss the red, toss the red, toss the red. Toss you, pal, there. Okay, now they can work on that gate while my very few yellows I have here, we're gonna do some exploring. I will come back to them later. And you are demonstrating amazing Pikmin AI. Good job, buddy. Doing your kind a lot of good. So, this should be... Yes, this is where... Tomarks can be found. So... How do... Maybe we should have brought more Pikmin. You know what? At least we need... I have an idea of what we can do. I feel like it's the same thing we tried the other day, though, and it did not go well at all, but, eh, who knows? Maybe the times will be different. We'll just have to see. It's also... Looks like these Pikmin just finished up, so we can go ahead and continue on what we were doing down this road. What can we find over here? Possibly more bad AI. Oh boy! Geysers! Yeah, they will, uh, they will turn your Pikmin into barbecue Pikmin. Might be able to get this. So, be very careful of them. We've got a bridge here, so we will have our Pikmin work on that. And is there anything over here that we're going to need to be concerned about later? There probably is. Yeah, I already see a ship part. I found my analog computer. This computer conveys the kind of vague data that falls outside the range of ones and zeros. Actually, to be honest, it's a little bit too vague, so it isn't very helpful. Looks like we're going to be needing some blues and possibly some reds as well. To be able to get that one. There's an iridescent flip beetle. Not like we can do much with it, but it's there. Oh yeah, and this thing right here, as you might be able to see, you want to be careful with it. You want to make sure only blues take that because it seems to be throwing Pikmin straight into water. Because it can. And they're still working on that, which is not too surprising to me. Oh. But they finished that. And I'm just crazy. And I am just crazy, but that's up to your discretion. Okay. Sometime today. Soon? Okay. We've got that done. So now, looks like we're going to have to do some puzzle something. Pikmin! Get out of the water. Okay, let's leave you there. Let's get our blues. And have them open up this geyser for us. That way. And out up here. So this is a puzzle that, in order to get the ship part back, we need all three Pikmin. So it's a good thing we brought all three types of Pikmin. First, we need the blues to do that. Then, we need to throw our yellows up here, because blues will not go that high. Then we take the geyser up. 
throw him up here as well. And there's Pikmin drowning again, aren't there? Whistle him out. Run. God. Oh well, we found the Libra. My daughter gave this to me. It's named after her astrological sign. My sweet little girl. I wonder what she's doing right at this moment. Uh, probably not having to deal with bad Pikmin AI. I would hope not. That is a fate I don't want to put anybody through. Okay, let's get the blues and the yellows and... Remember when I said Pikmin AI is pretty bad? Yeah, it's, it's, it's bad. Okay, we... That requires 15, so... One, two. I want to just throw the minimum because we have another ship part we can go get. Which is why we are going to go try to get that right about now. Since a lot of the hazards are fire hazards, those reds should all be alright. I think we cleared out most of the Shearwigs while we were uh, out exploring. So, that is nice. So let's get this piece that's over here. Unfortunately, I think we're, like, it's gonna be a pretty good fact. Like, I can say with almost with 100% certainty. We're gonna have to go back, come back here another day, but oh well. That's not the worst thing in the world. Alright, so once again, because of the fire hazards, we're gonna take our reds and we want to have them carry this. With the fire and the flames, they carry on. Okay. Just as long as other color Pikmin don't... I think I see a few other... Pikmin. Yep. Smart Pikmin. Okay, that should have weeded out the, uh, the non-reds. Never mind. Apparently, I am full of it. Alright, you want to get to an area where I can actually do stuff? Because if I go too far ahead, some of our Pikmin are going to try to latch onto that piece. Okay, maybe if we just do this. Okay, good. Just walk past the fiery blowhog. Oh, f screw you! Screw you! Ugh! Fiery blowhogs are the worst. And that's a massive Pikmin genocide if I've ever seen one. Let's get out of here. Before more trouble comes along. Um, we're almost at the end of the day, of the day too. Dang it. Alright. Well, I wasn't expecting to get that far. So what I at least want to do... Hopefully they'll get those pieces back in time. The pieces that we're currently carrying. I think they will. They should. Get better. So we're gonna put the Pikmin we have with us back. And we're gonna go try to make a few shortcuts for the next time we come back here. Because the way like what I'm thinking right now is we'll do what we can here. Uh we'll head back to the Forest of Hope in the next episode, then come back here and finish this 100%. And then all we'll have left basically is the distance spring, and then, well, we'll be done. So we're getting those back. Pikmin are still tripping. Things are mostly going according to plan. Libra, my daughter gave this to me. My late return must have her very worried. 17 out of 30. 12 more and we can increase our ship's flying capabilities. 13 more pieces in the game. Alright. Where are those? Yeah, maybe I should also make sure. Are there any strays? It doesn't look like it. Well, there's those Pikmin. Which it looks like they finished the job that I sent them to do. So, all we gotta do now is make a bunch of shortcuts. That should be fairly easy if we have the time to do so. And I got the computer back! 
So, two pieces. I'd say that's the least productive day. Analog computer. This straightens the outward er emotions of the dolphin's computer. While it does make the computer smart, it also makes it quick to anger. It's just like my boss. 18 out of 30. Getting closer. Alright, let's get as many bomb rocks as we possibly can. That should be a good number. Okay, you should be able to all... Uh, we're not going to have enough time to do any of this, are we? Well, we'll try. My goal is not really to get any more ship pieces. That, I think, we're not going to deny is kind of impossible to do at this point. But I want to at least break a few walls. Like, there's one near our base, for example. I want to break that wall if I can help it. How rude can geysers be? Or this... This is the exact same problem we had last time. I was the Pikmin, and then they just dropped all our bombs. Because... Why not? Hmm. Well, I think I have an idea of how we can modify this for the next time we are, we're back here. So we'll just let time run out. I know I could just go to the end of the day, but where's the fun in that? Oh well, we got two pieces, and when we come back here next, we should be able to get the last two. days since impact. It is very strange. The scenery of this planet, which I once, once found hostile, now sometimes strikes me as surprisingly serene. Perhaps the Pikmin have opened my heart to the beauty of this world. I even started thinking there were some parts I do not need. A daydream. We lost a lot of Pikmin in battle. That was not a pleasing day, but definitely definitely could have been much worse. So let's go ahead and save. And... Oh, we only have one more part in the... Right, because... I've com right. I completely forgot about the part we got at the start, because we started to get it. Yeah, we got three parts, then. Sweet deal. That leaves one more part in the Forest Naval, one more part in the Forest of Hope, and most of the parts in the distant spring. So, next time on Pikmin, we're going to be returning back to the Forest of Hope to get the last piece in this area. Afterwards, I think it would be best if we spent some time trying to sprout some more Pikmin, because we might as well make sure our numbers are pretty high, because you never know what could happen in areas like the distant spring. See you guys then.